Hey guys, how are you? I hope you're well and having a really good day today. Today's video is going to be a favourite from the USA basically. Um, so I've done many many swaps um, with people from the USA. I have um, loads of swap videos on my channel if you want to check them out. And these are some of my favourite things which I have received in swaps. Um, this is a collab with Lady Leopard 29 my good friend Rose, who I have swapped with many times, who I absolutely love, and the lovely Amy, whose YouTube is UE, I think that's how you say it. So they'll both be linked down below, so make sure you check out their channels and their videos. This way you can see lots of um, other products from other countries, whether you live in the UK or US or somewhere else. It's just a really good video so I do have a lot a lot of items here I did try to restrict it to about 10 but I've gone a bit overboard um, if you like the makeup I am wearing at the moment I have done a tutorial so I'll link that down below as well so don't forget to like subscribe check out the down bar for all my information and let's get into the video so literally I'm just gonna grab and go whatever I see first I will talk about so I have the Wet n Wild Mega Last Matte Lipsticks. So they are, I'll show you one for now. They have black packaging with a clear lid. Now the packaging does get extremely messy. For example, this one and the packaging's really flimsy. I wouldn't keep these in your handbag, which I did and it got ruined. So not a good look. So I have five of these and I am absolutely in love and I really, really, really want more. These are so affordable. I've read up that they're like $2. So please, if I swap with you, please get me more of these. So the colours I have are Don't Blink Pink, which is a, just a gorgeous bright pink shade. I have got Dollhouse Pink, which is like a blue undertone pink. It is very, very pale. Mm, I can't really pull this off, to be honest, unless I have like a really dark gloss over the top so that one's a bit miss for me and one of my favorites is smoking hot pink which is the one that exploded in my bag but it's so beautiful and they're matte and they're really amazing on the lips they are not drying at all and they really do last a long time and this one is mellow mauve which is a really pretty color so it's like a purpley pink and then the last one is cherry bomb which is a really dark color really great for autumn so that is those and um, some more lip products i have are the milani what are these the milani lipsticks i don't know the exact range but they come in the gold tubes like this so i have three of these um, I have got Rose Hip, which is just a gorgeous, really bright pink. These are really, really moisturising and the colour payoff is beautiful. I don't really like the smell though, but it does wear off after a while. Um, Fruit Punch, which is a really cute baby pink colour. Really, really pretty, but it's not too pale, so you can still work it. And this is um, a very popular one, it's Sangria. And this is supposed to be a dupe of Max Rebel. I haven't worn this yet but I really want to but it's a bit summery now so I'm gonna wait for like the darker months I'm just gonna do lip products at <laughs> first the NYX butter glosses um, they are just amazing they're amazing glosses and they're so so pigmented I have got creme brulee which I actually have on today and I have got peaches and cream which is a gorgeous pink color um, so absolutely love them they're really pigmented and really really lovely and then another product um, Essence is actually now sold in the UK so I do feel a little bad mentioning this I am going to do a whole other video on Essence products I believe I think so anyway but this is one of my favourite products ever this is the Essence Stay Matte Lip Cream and I don't know if I've actually seen this or not um, but this is in the colour Smooth Berry I have two of these, I have this one and my favourite milkshake, but my favourite milkshake is a bit pale for me, so I'm not going to mention it, but this one, it actually comes out the colour that is in the tube, it's so bright and it just feels amazing on the lips, 
it smells beautiful and it's just really really pigmented and it looks amazing and Essence is a really really cheap brand so if you can get your hands on these then do um, and it's just really pigmented lip colour so that's everything for the lips I would I would grab more if I could but I was trying to keep it to the bare minimum and things which I absolutely love and need in my collection at all times let's go on to face products next the next things I have are these wet and wild blushes so I have two of them um, if I am swapping with you please get me more of these because they are absolutely phenomenal so my favourite one is pearlescent pink which looks like this I've used this in tutorials loads of times I use this in my Minnie Mouse one or I might have used the other one I use one of these but it's just a really gorgeous colour it's so so pigmented really want to try more of them and this one is called Mellow Wine it's a bit darker so it will be really great for autumn and winter really really beautiful then I have my favourite blusher in the world and this is the Fox in a Box by Hard Candy and this is in Spicy and Sweet so it comes in a little box like this and it's got a little bronzer shade and then three pink blusher shades again I'm running low so I do need to get another one of these and this is just beautiful um, and could someone let me know which stores actually sell hard candy because I'm going to Florida um, in March and I'm making a list of everywhere I need to go and need to pick up hard candy and stuff so if you could let me know that would be great and Milani as well speaking of Milani I have got a Milani powder blush in love potion it looks like this and it's one of the rose ones Milani packaging is just stunning and this looks like a rose and I just, I've used it and it's such a beautiful, beautiful colour. I don't want to use it too much just because it's so beautiful and I do not want to ruin it. But absolutely stunning. And then I have a bronzer. I haven't tried that many bronzers from the USA. I've tried, I think, I've got two Wet n Wild ones which are really good. And this NYX one, this is the NYX Matte Bronzer in Medium packaging looks like this and I absolutely adore this so again holla really really beautiful colour um, so yeah I haven't actually tried that many I've tried about three of the like American bronzers but I really really love that one and I do like the wet and wild ones as well but they are a little bit crumbly um, oh I missed out a lip product this is a, a, an EOS um, and this is a vanilla one and I'm very very low this is my favourite flavour it's so soft and it smells amazing I'm not really fan of the lemon one anymore because it's just not soft and it doesn't glide on you kind of have to rub then we move on to eye products so of course the famous wet and wild eyeshadows I have got to mention them so I do have quite a few but I've just brought out my favourite palettes to show you I do have a lot more than this <laughs> But I'm um, to show my favourite. So this is um, a palette with eight shades. And this is called Blue Had Me At Hello. Absolutely stunning. These are so pigmented. And they are just the most beautiful eyeshadows. Um, and this is Petal Pressure. This was the first one I ever got. And I absolutely love it. It's so beautiful. And then this is a new one which I actually used today for my eye shadows and this is Walking the Red Carpet and I'm not sure if this is limited edition but it looks like this and oh it's just so beautiful and I used it today so don't forget to check out my tutorial. And then I have a mini one and this is On Cloud 9 and this just has three in and again I have quite a few of these but this is one of my favourites so it looks like that and it's just so stunning absolutely love them the next product again is from essence which is now in the uk so you can buy this um and my friend rose sent me this and it's the essence eye heart stage eyeshadow base and i have done a review of this um like a comparison between this and the urban decay primer potion so we'll link it down below this is literally exactly the same as urban decay except under circumstances where it is so hot that you are literally dripping with sweat 
I know it's disgusting, but in them circumstances, this doesn't really work, whereas MDK would, but for everyday use. And when you're not dripping with sweat, and it's not like um, 30 degrees outside, this is just absolutely amazing. The consistency is the same as Urban Decay, and this is like £2.50 in the UK, whereas Urban Decay is about 18 So, um, for this compared to that, it's just amazing. Um, definitely recommend it, and you need to try it. It's amazing. It's better than Elf. It's the same as Urban Decay, which has been my holy grail for years. Um, but I've got like three backups of these and I'm just really loving it and I definitely recommend it. Um, and now I have an Essence Long Lasting Eye Pencil in Black Fever. Again, Essence, just a really amazing brand. My friend Rose sent me about ten of these to keep me going. So you just slide it up like so and honestly, my sister swears by this as well. It lasts for absolutely ages in the waterline and it's just really, really nice. So so cheap as well and then we get on to eyeshadows essence eyeshadows are amazing um not so much the eyeshadows in the palette i found that they weren't as pigmented as the single eyeshadows um but here i do have a lot of single eyeshadows and i swear by them they're beautiful they're pigmented they're stunning and they just look amazing on the eyes my favorites would have to be the 3d eyeshadows which look like this so it says wow 3d eyeshadow um, and they look like this, so they have two shades in them. This is Irresistible Purple, so it has a lighter shade and a darker shade. So stunning. And this is Irresistible Blue Sky. Again, this is one of my favourites as well. Just look at that, so pigmented and beautiful. This is Irresistible Caramel Cream. Again, an all-time favourite. I love this one, just and just both of them actually, it's so beautiful. Another nude is Irresistible Chocolates. Again, absolutely beautiful. I literally love these so much. And this one is Irresistible Foxtrot. Um, I haven't used this one yet, but it looks stunning. And then... I have got Irresistible Smoky Eye, so this one is really good for smoky eyes. Every time I do a smoky eye, I will use this. And then I have some single eyeshadows, so I have got one matte one, and this is in Blockbuster, and it's just amazing highlight for the brow bone, just really, really nice. So as you can see, it's just matte and very very nice you can't complain um, and then my all time favourites is Cappuccino Keys which is really similar to Verve by Urban Decay which is in the a Naked 2 palette and that is just such a beautiful colour and then these two I haven't used because I did a purchase quite recently so this one is in Sandy Says Hello which I love because it just reminds me of Greece and Sandy. So that does look really pretty. Wow. That is super stunning. Now I just want to use this even more because of how beautiful that swatch was. And this one is Peach Beach. And I haven't used this one either. Oh, again. Done in. Sorry about the foundation on my hand, but see that was just such a light swatch and it's already so pigmented. I'm gonna have one more product and it's for your face and it's a hard candy glamouflage gla heavy duty concealer. So this is my new one in a packet because I couldn't find my open one already. So it's just really amazing. It's a heavy duty concealer, like it says really full coverage, um, and it's just really amazing. So that's it for this video, um, I hope you enjoyed and I hope it showed you some new products. If you want to see another video on kind of essence products and more detailed swatches then let me know, I'd be more than happy to do that. If you want to see my swap videos, I'll have some of them linked down below and then they're in a playlist so you can just go see from there but I do love swapping. 
and I love all the products I get and I'm really thankful that I get to try products from other countries and I cannot wait for my holiday to Florida where I can just go shopping crazy. So that's it for this video, I really hope you enjoyed it, don't forget to check out my tutorial for this look, will be linked down below and probably somewhere around here um, and all my socks will be down below. So thanks so much for watching, please like, please hit subscribe and please check out the down bar for all my social media, that will be fab, so I'll see you next time, bye!